In this second video on hash tables, we're going to look at some simple pseudocode for adding, deleting and removing items from hash tables. OK, let's look at some pseudocode for searching a hash table. In each of these examples, the pseudocode is very simplistic. If you were actually to program this up in a procedural language, you would also need to add a lot more. But the logic is sound and should allow you to answer questions in the exam. So for searching an item in a hash table, we first feed the key into our hash function. We then go directly to the array index of the value that's chucked out by the hash function. If the value we're searching for is the value that's found, then we stop. If it's not, we then follow the linked list in sequence until the value is found. Inserting a value into a hash table is very similar. We first feed in the key to the hash function. We then go directly to the array index for the value generated. If the location is empty, we simply insert the value. If this statement is false, we follow the linked list in sequence until a free space is found and then we insert the value. Again, the code from deleting from hash tables is quite simple. We feed the key into the hash function. We go directly to the array index from the hash value generated. If the value we want to delete is the value we're searching for, then we mark it as empty. Otherwise, we follow the linked list in sequence until the value we want is found and we mark that as empty. We would then need to update any free pointers in our linked list.